Speaking of stupid things I like, corn. I do. You guys know I love corn. And you know what I really love? A corn thing I love very much, besides all of you, yes, you. But a corn thing I really love, a corn product, Fritos. Delicious, okay? Delightful. Until now. Fuck Frito-Lay. Fuck Frito-Lay. Frito-Lay looking to hire new employees during strike in Topeka. The Frito-Lay employees are striking. Don't buy Frito-Lay. We're gonna offer we're gonna offer some alternatives here. Can anyone find that tweet that went around? It's not all the alternatives, but I wanted to, I wanted to show everybody some alternatives to Frito Lay that they can go get and not support these motherfuckers. Okay. Some wheat ass behavior, absolutely. And right now, Frito Lay in Topeka is looking for more workers after labor union employees went on strike. Thanks for joining us tonight on Brooke Lennington. And KSNT news reporter Kelly Peltier joins us. Oh, I thought she started ripping ass. I thought that was a, a, an ass rip, dude. It's live outside the plant where union workers are entering now day four of their strike. Kelly? Brooke, employees tell me when they found out the company is looking to replace them, they felt even more unappreciated than they did before. But they say that's not stopping their plans, though. You can see some of those employees out here right now behind me. They say they plan to continue to strike out here for better pay and working conditions. Today marks day four of Frito-Lay workers in Topeka striking for better working conditions. They just want to give us coins. They don't want to give us enough to pay our bills, feed our children. You're damn right. Get it. Get it. Fuck that shit. Hey, you know what? If I was a company, you know what I would do if I wanted labor? I would simply pay the labor. I would simply pay them. Our mortgage and our rent. Monk Drapo Stewart has worked for Frito Lay for 16 years. He 16 years? How much does this dude make? He says when he started nearly two decades ago, it was the last contract he received from the company with their raises. Employees made 25 cents extra per hour for their first year, 50 cents extra the second year, and then 25 cents on the third year. Now those raises are less. The first year you get a lump sum, which is a pittance, and then they put a 40% gift tax on top of that. So you're only getting 60% of a pittance. The second year, same thing. Third year, 1% raise. Which Based. Crush it. Which was about 19 cents an hour. Fuck Aside that from shit, dude. Pay, many 19 on the picket cents, line are dude. Fighting cents. for a safer working environment. Caitlin Renfro is another frustrated Frito-Lay employee on strike. She's worked for the company the last seven years. She says her goal in striking is for owners to listen to their employees and Damn come right. to an agreement that's fair for everyone. For the most part, we like working here. We just, we want to be treated better. None of these motherfuckers better vote Republican ever again. Ever. Get the fuck after it. Get your rights. And we want to be shown that they do appreciate us. And that's by... Gray Fox, thanks for the 28 months, dude. Giving us a decent raise, which they haven't done for over a decade. I did reach out to Frito-Lay earlier today for a response to the strike, but I haven't heard back. Reporting live in Topeka, covering local news that matters, Kelly Peltier, KSNT News. All right, so... Uh, that's not the end of this story. That's just the, the more of the preface. The rest of this... Voter no, fraud is very, very shh, rare. Shh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Stop it. Stop it. I didn't, I, I didn't need you to talk, Rachel Maddow. That's not, it was not intentional for me. It's my show, okay? Get your own. Okay? Not that anyone will watch you. Who are you? Um, don't you know how many subscribers I have on twitch.tv slash actual Jake? <laughs> Imagine. Imagine working for MSNBC. Yikes. Low tier. Okay, so uh, uh, so here are some options for Frito-Lay that you, you can't eat. So if you don't see your thing on here, it might be Frito-Lay. Okay? So we're not supporting Frito-Lay. All right? Fuck them. They're dead to me. It's over for them. The corn, the corn bump, even though I loved Fritos. I loved them. One of my favorite things. We're finding a new corn chip chat. So here's some options that you can go with. I'll do it on the big screen so you can see it better. Uh, actually, I can do it like this and then zoom in. That'll be fine. You deserve the flags. So uh, bugles. I got some in my house right now. Bugles are delicious. 
These are also made of corn, and they're real tasty, okay? They're underrated, and they're super cheap. You can get bags of these for a dollar, okay? Super cheap. Obviously, Takis, these are super good. Uh, if you don't like spicy stuff, probably don't go this way. A little crunchy, too. If you got oh, sensitive teeth, probably not your shit. Really. I'm going to go through every snack on here, okay? Uh, Art Tavilla, thanks for following. I also got some stuff not on these lists. Uh, Pringles, everyone knows Pringles, delicious on the border. These are great chips. Snyder's of Hanover, uh, not just the cheddar cheese pieces, but all their stuff. Used to get the sourdough nibblers, dude. If you like, if you like some pretzels, Snyder's is great. Uts, anything by Uts. Uts cheese balls are here too. Super good. Anything by Uts, amazing. Uh, Terra chips. These are super, super good. Um, I believe they're vegan. Uh, not a lot of things are vegan, but uh, these are definitely vegan. Um, they take uh, different pieces of, like, this is beet. Uh, I think this is taro. They have sweet potato. Um, I think parsnip, maybe. They do other stuff. They also do just sweet potato. They do, they do different blends of these. These are super good. Uh, veggie straws. Who doesn't love a veggie straw? These are tasty. Potato skins from TJ Fridays. These are bad for you. You can eat them if you want, though. Um, they're fine. I don't really fuck with these very much. Mission style, very good. I've never had golden flake, but they look delightful. Uh, wrap snacks, Migos wrap snacks. Never had these. Uh, I have seen them though. Uh, pop chips are okay. They're not really my thing. Uh, I don't think I've ever had uh, Kalidad or Kalidad. Zaps. This is the shit. Okay, this is like down in Louisiana, New Orleans kettle style. These voodoo chips don't taste like anything you've ever had, but they make they make um two of these. I'll show you. They make uh Zaps chips. Oops. You can just get them on the. Uh, you, you can order them on the internet for for pretty chill um, amounts of money. But uh, uh, Cajun dill gator taters are amazing. Okay, a little spicy dill action. You want that shit in your life? I've never had hotter and hot jalapeno. I don't think I never had evil eye either. But new, new spicy Cajun craw taters. Come these on. are the best chips on planet Earth. Come. It's not even close. Uh, Colts fan three five four. Thanks so much for the four months, dude. Evening. Evening to you as well. These are super good. All of these are good, though. Any Anyone I've ever had are good. I, I just haven't had the, the evil eye. I might have to get some, unless they're super hot. They make voodoo, and they also make, like, a voodoo heat, which is a hotter one. Uh, what's evil eye? They don't even t tell you. Evil eye? What, even, what the fuck are they? I don't even know. Yeah, super good. Get them all and do live taste tests. I've done it before, but I'll do it again. I don't care. They're really great. Anyway, uh, I'm, I'm a big fan of Zaps because uh, uh, Sarah introduced ac ac I don't know why I can't speak. Sarah actually introduced these to me. Uh, Cheez-Its, obviously very good. Hers are good, uh, as shown in the uh, uh, the office. Uh, great value. It's fine. Cape Cod is really good. These are really good kettle chips, if you like that. Um, they have Kettle Brand, Chex Mix, Gardettos. You guys know that. Some more Skinny Pop, Juanitas. Pirate Booty. Okay, this stuff is actually really, really tasty. I've never had Fody, Wise, Old Dutch, uh, Vintner. Corn nuts are, are, are lovely, obviously. Sponsor me. Um, uh, Tim's, I haven't had it. Uncle Ray's are super good. Uh, Middles Wharf, never heard of this in my life. Clancy's never heard of it, so maybe it's good. However, something that's not on here that you can get in the Midwest, especially in, uh, in uh, Michigan, you can get better made chips, dude. I'm telling you, better made potato chips. The packaging is not good. Okay, the packaging is is real dated. They're made in Michigan. You can get them kind of in the area, but if you can find these, if you can find these somewhere, I'm telling you, dude, your chip game is gonna be nuts. These are so good. I'm trying to find like a good picture, of like multiple. That's a pretty good one. Um, they're so good, dude. I can't. I can't. I can't. Uh, like this sweet heat barbecue, this this ruffle style, this shit's good. And Better Made makes all sorts of stuff. They make amazing popcorn, dude. Like really, really good popcorn. I'm sure. I'm sure I can just type in popcorn. Uh, got some of this stuff. This right here, Detroit mix, caramel and cheese. You might think that's gross. Detroit mix, nuts. So good. Jalen Rose always advocates advocate, advocates advocates for this. Jalen Rose is based as fuck. He's from here, dude. He knows. He gets it. Why is this called Chicago style? Are they are they fucking wow, dude. They just they just put it on whatever. 
Uh, this is called in in Detroit. It's called Detroit style all the time. I don't know why this is called Chicago style. I don't know if they do. Maybe they do the same thing. I don't know. Uh, really good. And I don't really like sweet stuff. Their butter popcorn is fucking bonkers, and it's cheap. It's real cheap. Anyway, go get some better made stuff. Really good. Fuck Frito Lay. So that means Fritos, Lays. Uh, I think Cheetos. I think uh, Doritos. Stuff like that. It's fucking war, dude. The fuck it, Chicago style? I mean, I don't know. There's tons of brands that say Detroit style for that specific blend. But I don't know. My heart is broken. Yeah, Sun Chips are delicious. Well, when they start paying their workers again, then you can go back to them. But until then, fuck them. Fuck them.